you have a black daughter, right? Uh, you, uh-huh. have da- you ever comb her hair? I've tried. Yeah, I, I'm bad at that too. But it's hard not to be a dad combing a little girl's hair. Right. It, that's it, you just mixed girl, it. Rubik's cube. Yeah, yeah, she looked like every time I like when my wife would be out of town and I'd have to get her ready for school. She looked like one of the heart monitors. Right. Like, <laughs> <laughs> and I'm not lying. Like literally, like kindergarten, first grade year. When my wife was out of town, I'd drop her off at school, and like people knew I had her because right. of her hair. Right. And like the principal would be like, "Wife out of town again? <laughs> yeah. like, why, why you keep telling people yes. I'm out of town?" She goes, "No, nah, well they yes. know." <laughs> yes. I, would, I would get literally there was a a black lady working in the school cafeteria. <laughs> So I just throw a couple extra dollars, take my daughter back in the kitchen, get to right. school about 10 minutes early. She hooked my daughter's hair up. <laughs> yeah. It's good. Drink them good elementary school chocolate milks. Yes. Good all morning. There you go. <laughs> you black know? women do not like to see a kid's they, hair. That's what she no. did. Mr. Gary, bring her back here. Mr. Gary. Mr. Gary, bring her back here. that up. Do you think that the reason that you're endearing to, to us is because you've had experiences and been able to talk about them that no one like I don't know that anyone I think people are having a lot more of those experiences mm-hmm. but they don't have a place to talk to them about right. it. like you have a I think maybe maybe black people trust me right you know right. I'm on their side that's weird you more, than, more than a lot of white people I'm, right. I'm on their side right. oh yeah well, because yeah. I because I, I know that's my fan base and I know they they put a lot of money in my pockets over the years so but also course, you're raising them I'm raising That's them what too. I was about to say. Right. Well, you ain't lying. Yeah. <laughs> and my daughter's the militant one. <laughs> called Kennedy Kaepernick. <laughs> what did she say? He, well, she's. I, I'm telling you, she's gonna. I put money on. She'll be at an HBCU, and get ready. She's gonna be the one leading the protests right. and the marches. Right. And they like, all end up in your kitchen. What? Are, what? Right. Are you <laughs> well, like, like she got mad at me because I stood up there in the national anthem. She was like, you just going to stand? I go, it's a seventh grade volleyball game. Let's bring it down to <laughs> 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 17 people in the church. 